Hi, I'm Erica Fisher, and I'm a digital marketing consultant. In this video, we're going to go over the different keyword match types that you can use for the Google Ads platform. There are four different keyword match types that you can use in Google Ads. Exact, phrase, broad, and broad match modifier. Here's how you use each. Exact match. Using an exact match keyword means that your ads will be shown to people who are searching for a specific keyword that you're bidding on or very close variants of that keyword. Close variants include searches for keywords with the same meaning as the exact keywords, regardless of spelling or grammar similarities between the query and the keyword. For example, boxing gloves or gloves for boxing will both show your ad regardless of which keyword that you use. Bids for exact match keywords tend to be the most expensive type of keyword match to bid on because they're very accurate. Phrase match. Using a phrase match keyword means that your ads will be shown to people who are searching for exact matches to your keyword or close variants of your keyword with additional words before and after. For example, if your keyword is boxing gloves, people who search for leather boxing gloves, red boxing gloves, and small boxing gloves will still see your ad. Bids for phrase match keywords tend to be in the mid-range price-wise to bid on. Broad match. Using a broad match keyword means that your ads will be shown to people who are searching for your exact phrase, similar phrases, singular or plural forms, misspellings, synonyms, stemmings, such as floor and flooring, related searches, and other relevant variations. Although this tends to be the least expensive keyword match type, unless you understand how to create negative keyword lists or understand how to use the search term report to determine which negative keywords to add to your list, I do not recommend using this match type. I'm gonna make a whole video on search term reports and how to optimize them, so check for that link in this video's description. Bids for broad match keywords tend to be in the low range price-wise to bid on. Broad match modifier. Using a broad match modifier keyword gives you more control when using broad match keywords. Here's how they work. You add a plus sign in front of a single word that needs to be included in the person's search in order to have your ad shown to them. For example, if I'm selling a t-shirt with a cat on it, but I only have it in white, black, or gray, then I would bid on a keyword like this. This would ensure that the person who is searching for a cat shirt also will be willing to buy the colors that I have in stock, as long as they're including the color of the shirt that they are searching for. If you want to learn more about Google Ads and how to set up campaigns, check out my online course, How to Set Up Your First Google Ads Campaign. The link is in the description below. 